Mamma, I'm a What? So sweet. Hey guys, what's good? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your babe and Bonnet. Thank you so much for stopping by. So today we are here at Bonds Island. I just want to take you guys along what really this place looks like because we all know okay we all know we've been talking about bond people are talking about it the historic buildings and all of those things you guys will get to see in my vlog okay so right now i'm standing at the bond clock tower and you guys can see how clean this place looks bond is a beautiful island in the southern province of sierra leone and this place has lots of history when the captives came back to sierra leone some of them stayed in freetown the central part of freetown while some of them went to bond and that is why you'll find out that most of their houses look like those you'll find in the center of freetown now bond is home to lots of different tribes mainly the mendes and the Sher Bros. so at first i was thinking it was just home for the shabros what we call shebra but then when i went there i noticed that they have lots of mende in fact i want to believe they have more mendes in bond than shabros honestly that is what i feel because you you meet lots of mende people people talk mende all over the place and yeah this place is beautiful and let's take a tour This is the St. Matthew's Church and we are lucky enough to see someone that takes care of it and that person has let us in so that we can see Yes, the oh, 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 look at the attendance in those days. People they cry more than. We are taking a look at the attendance list, and can you guys see? January nineteen thirty-two. <laughs> you guys. When are the church in him? Then first day. You go first, you go first. Are you my next one? You go first. When you put your foot on a fire, do not find no piece of body. When you come back and look to Coco Rosso, oh, 
Bond Secondary School, founded in 1962. Dr. Olose, we are the number one. Dr. Olose, we are the number one. We say no fight. We say no brutality. It's another PZ building and it says Patterson, Zoconi and Co. So in case you don't know, like me, this is what PZ means and it is not operating anymore. As you guys can see, this is one of the oldest buildings and there is nothing going on there. It used to be a business place. Oh, yeah. morning guys what's good it's the next day today is sunday and we are about leaving we'll leave at around 9 30 because i need to get to boat today and i need to get to free town today as well because i need to work tomorrow obviously so um you guys have seen the structures you guys have seen the township of bond it is a beautiful place i must say and i love the fact that it is really planned like the streets the streets are straight. If you've been to Waterloo Village, then you know what I'm talking about. It is really planned, no congestion and none of that. But um, I guess it is under rehabilitation, according to what the you know, people here are talking about. I think this place has been neglected for a long while, but things are coming back together. You see lots of construction going on and all of that. But on a whole, it's a beautiful place, the atmosphere and all. But then we expected a lot more, right? So we've had our bonds and all, but I guess it's because they are going through a phase right now and yeah, but it's a beautiful place. The only thing is we didn't, we didn't see someone that could really take us around and explain the history of the place. They told us about one um, Madame Govi, but we, we, we couldn't see her because I was hoping we can have someone that can really tell us the history of bonds, you know, the churches, the old buildings, but we didn't find it was just one shot that we saw someone who lets us in so that we can film but other than that all of the other churches were closed nobody to tell us anything about them but yeah we're leaving and bond has been good to us thank you so much we are hoping to get the kakunde this morning so that we can take that with us on the journey back to what is kakunde um okay sorry kakunde is a type of palm wine i guess yeah, I like this. Mm -hmm. I think it's I think it's a, it's a different kind of palm wine that is more intoxicating. But I think it is sweet. I've not had it and we hope to have it so that so that the speedboat ride will be juicy on our way back to Bo. But yeah, this has been it. I just want to show you guys this room, the guest house that we are staying. It is nothing big, nothing much, but I mean you, this is one of the best you can get for a place like this because this is an island and you don't expect it to be like free town okay so what i really love the place you know it has the basic things that you'll need we have the bed and there is a bed net because mosquitoes <laughs> so you have the bed and the bed net and they also have this little balcony here which i really like because if it's hot in you can just move out and I love it. This is something I love in houses and I can't wait to build my mansion with a super cute balcony. You have chairs, 
you have three chairs which is really enough i mean you can change locations if you want and they have this thing made of cane here as a table they have a flask there is a fan there is the ac and they have this little dresser slash mirror over here you have the the bathroom slash wardrobe slash everything dressing in here so yeah that's just it's very basic nothing special but when you come to places like this you don't expect to see any five stars as it is now which is what we are hoping for in the near future we were on our way out and we were like bro bro we didn't get to see much we didn't get to see any other thing apart from the structures what is it about bond and then we met this lady making palm oil and even though this is small scale but you get to see snippets of what the palm oil process is like and we get to see oyster krakunde all of those things enjoy <laughs> So you guys, this is the oyster making process. Now they boil and for say. Okay, so they boil and then they remove from the shells. Okay. Sorry, I don't know if I see. Okay. Aww. Mm, thank you. So this now after one I don't boil and say. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't boil it. You not come more bulk one. I think that's it for the share. Daru! Daru! Eh, eh, then I. So guys, we are buying um kuakunde. It is something like palm wine, but not palm wine, right? It's a symbol. What? <laughs> so sweet. So no sugar, uh, um, no sugar, no sugar, no sugar. No sugar. <laughs> Guys, if you ever come to Bon, you need to try Krakunde. I mean, it tastes like palm wine with lots of sugar, but then there's no sugar in it. <laughs> Everywhere I go, yeah. 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 Everywh